To understand why Germany entered World War I, you must first need to understand some of the major causes of World War I. Although the trigger of war was the assassination of Archduke Franz Ferdinand, many other factors led to the chaos of 1914. And here are some of and here are some of the factors of World War One. And here are some of the factors that led to Germany joining World War One. Number one, colonialism. Germany was an emerging superpower and wanted to compete on the world stage. They achieved this through expansion into Africa, Micronesia, and the concession in China, Tsingtao, which often put them at odds with the French and nationalism. Germany was at odds with France with the unification in 1871 and the loss of the 1870 war or the Franco-German war that took Alsace-Lorraine. Many people saw the war as inevitable and wanted another chance to show their military glory and retake Alsace-Lorraine. Previous crises, early events like the arms race of the sea between the British and the Germans to build up the biggest navy, the Agadir crisis which actually put Germany at odds with France and their French Morocco territory and especially France with Germany over the annexation of Alsace-Lorraine in 1871. And Russia, well, supporting Austro-Hungary's um, expansion into the Balkans more or less, but the Russians and the Germans kinda had something going way before Austro-Hungary was on the scene. A major cause of war with Russia was when Austria and Russia had been locked into conflict over the Balkans ever since the Ottoman Empire left and had started to lose control in the region following the Great Turkish Wars from the 1600s to the Russo-Turkish War and both superpowers wanted the region for themselves. Germany has started to grow afraid of Russia as well, especially since they have started to recover from their defeat after the Russo-Japanese War. Many people in Germany, the High Command and even the Kaiser himself felt that if Russia was not dealt with soon, it would become powerful enough. It would become the manpower of the British Empire with the technology of Germany and having both France and Russia at their doorstep posed a serious threat to German security. So when Austria declared war on Serbia in 1914, Germany came to its aid to protect its borders, to of course respect its alliance with Austria-Hungary but most of all to gain Central European supremacy and of course protect their borders as well. Yes, I believe that is everything why Germany went to war in World War One. Thanks for watching guys. Um, basically, naval supremacy, Central European supremacy, controlling its borders, and pretty much trying to become a world power by colonialism. And I mean, ever since Germany was unified in 1871, they kind- wait, was Europe- wait, hold on, was Italy- I think Italy was in 18. 80 I believe so but they did had Libya which they did had Libya which was pretty like five times the size of Italy so that's not too bad but Germany had Southwest Africa Togoland Southeast Africa Nero Dinija and Nunib um, Lake Tanzania the region in Lake Tanzania or Tanzania you are now to call it but they pretty much had Lake Tanzania which was still on the east but alone, I can't remember that. I can't remember what it's called. But anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And Uba Alice, Uba Alice, Deutsche Slan. We have now entered the final season. America would be kind of a season, but not the 10 parts. It'll just be like arms, famous people, and a battle or two, and a magnum opus. So it's not really, not really a season, just like a prelude or foreshadowing towards World War 2 and yeah that's pretty much it there's one thing on my mind though like um, for example if I have the 1911 and I did it in World War 1 and of course there's a couple of ergonomic changes but at the end of the day it's still the 1911 but I guess I will find something to work around with I don't know anyway hope you enjoyed hope you learned something and I I would I would find something the name though, yeah, the name is what's going to get me. But anyway, hope you enjoyed, hope you learned something. Um, a bit more structured than all of the countries during World War One, but Germany is kind of the last season, so you got to make it concrete. Anyway, hope you learned something, and I'll see you tomorrow for two videos. Yeah, of course, sleeping plan and maybe half moon. Enjoy, learn something.